Hi, it's uh, Robbie here from Planet Wash, here with the band Australia, uh, playing at the Leo tonight. Uh, like to introduce yourself, guys. Yeah. Yeah, I'm Leo, I'm the drummer. I'm Paul, the lead singer. And Nathan Gunn, the bassist. I'm Luke, the lead guitarist. Uh, so, uh, the last time I saw you guys, you were actually in the uh, classic band playing for the Highway to Hell. I was right, yeah. 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 And uh, so, what's been happening since, since then? Uh, well, since then, classic grand. Well, we, we we got through. I think it was a hell competition. We got through to play at the um, Hard Rock Hell in um, December. I think it was end yeah, of November. December. Yeah. Um, we got to play. It was an awesome, great, great gig. Cause we got to play on the the main stage. Yeah. It's, well, it's always great when you get to play in the big stages and you know the lights and the whole shebang. So um, from that, we we played a few gigs at the end of the year to finish up, or we did a hometown gig. Yeah. Sort of last. I think it was the last gig of the year just to finish up. Going back to you know where we sort of came from, way there. And the day day after the Howard Hill gig in Classic Grand, we drove to Germany for the Europe. Oh tour. yeah, I, forgot, I totally forgot that. <laughs> <laughs> we toured Europe. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I was I was going straight from that gig to Christmas time. Yeah, I, must I like Christmas time. Okay, yeah, must have some tour if you can remember. It. Oh yeah, oh, yeah, yeah. Um, no, like they say, so we probably just left um, next day after Howard Hill straight over to Germany. Like, oh, Twenty six hour drive. Uh, yeah. It's like non stop just swapping drivers and stuff. So the whole our European tour was brilliant with Rob Beck stuff. Mm. Quite experienced to get into Europe, you know, different yeah. countries and stuff. It's, it's great, yeah. It's what I found from what seeing you guys, that was the first time I've seen you guys. Uh, it brings a lot of the old classic seventies, eighties sound. Yeah, that's uh, awesome. and I think it's something that that's needed, you know, this day and age. Yeah, I think it's just keeping that sort of style of music and that fun time's yeah. going, you know, there's not a lot of bands in, in sort of nowadays that are sort of, you know, it's quite a lot of modern sort of bands, but we, we like that style of music, we've sort of grown up listening to it and we like playing it live, so that's what's kept us doing it and, you know, there is more and more bands around the world sort of coming back and sort of doing that style of music and it's great to be part of that, you know, sort of taking their back and... Um, but it's good to be a, a new band, it's fresh, you know, Yeah. So it's like, I thought it was like 70s, 80s influence. It's like for today, it's like it could be different because there's not as many bands doing it. Yeah. So it's like bringing it back, you know. Yeah. It's cool. That's true. That's a good point. <laughs> good point. <laughs> yeah, the album uh, come out to play. Um, how's it going? Do you know how? Yeah. How it, it was yeah. one that was first released. I think it was like a couple of months after we got uh, nominated for a Scottish New Music Award, which we went on to win. <laughs> so I'd only been out for I don't know what time maybe. Five months or something like that, yeah. it? Four or five months. Yeah. Um, and it's got great reviews in Classic Rock Magazine, Metal Hammer, Powerplay, Fireworks. Um, so it's been received really well and it's getting played um, worldwide, and, uh, worldwide and you know, state radio stations in the United States and Europe and Brazil and all that. So it's great that it's finally getting out and about. Mm -hmm. Next thing would be going tours of all these places where it's played. Yeah. So the States and, uh, you know. Pretty much all over the world. <laughs> One thing I'll I did though, is actually tr I looked, looked it up on iTunes. Uh, and did you know, I don't know if you're aware of this, but it's linked to another flamenco singer, Australia. Yes, yeah, yeah, um, yeah. <coughs> well, Are you aware of that? Yeah, we are. Yeah. But, but I've, the, I've read or something That's your biography. <laughs> oh, is it? No, I didn't know. It, it is. It's like <laughs> where we're born. That, that is your biography. If you scroll down, that's what is it, it comes up. It comes oh, up great, that's the, the, another biography. Another person's <laughs> right. biography. Great. I heard, I heard she's like finished now, so we can sort of <laughs> erase that part of Australia in there now, you know. Uh, yeah, uh, and what, you've got uh, a few gigs coming up in another festival that you... Yeah, yeah it's the Hard Rock Hell AOR Festival, which is on the 6th of April. So it's like, you know, That's it's a great lineup of bands, Tesla, uh, Danny Vaughan, Danny Vaughan, FM, awesome like lineups. Just a privilege to be asked to play it, you know. Yeah. Um, then after that, on the 9th, we're back in Glasgow, supporting Heat and um, Stereo. That's right. with the toy again. Yeah, so guys. That should be another great gig in Glasgow. And then, oh, what about Ibiza? I'll be fine. <laughs> Hard Rock Hill, Ibiza, and I think it's on 15th of 15th. May to 22nd. Yeah. It's like a week of rock bands over in Ibiza. It doesn't get better than that. In the sun, rocking night, chilling by the pool during the day, on the beer. Then, and oh, we've also got a gig, I think, too. <laughs> Bubble Rover Air. Oh, yeah, we're playing it as well, yeah. <laughs> Many other times, you know. Okay, we've also, also just been asked, <laughs> yeah. asked to play in September a new rock festival called Skyfest. Yeah. Uh, I've seen that, yeah. So it's a pretty, pretty amazing headline on Saturday and on Sunday. Raging Angels, is it? Raging Angels, I think it is, yeah. yeah. 
Um, so it looks quite decent, mate. Yeah. Yeah. When it comes to gigging yourself, do you prefer to do the uh, your own headline or festivals? Do you have any preference? Um, festivals, all is good. Alan's festivals yeah, are, are, are sort of better just now. Until yeah. we get like the fan base up to sort of fully raise your headline yeah. and you've got 60,000 and you just say anything for it and they'll do it. Yeah. That's yeah. when it's great. You know, you get to that stage. Just now we're sort of building it. So it's great to play at festivals as well because you get a meet mingle with the other bands. These yeah. are big bands and you can sort of maybe push a CD or uh, you know get some advice. So it's always good to. Uh, do any of you guys have any rituals or routines that you do before you actually hit the stage? We've, we've got one on stage before we actually start. It's just a wee. Uh, what do you call it? What do you call it? Yeah, ritual. We <laughs> 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 just sort of like Wembley yeah. Stadium, hundred people sort of thing. You know what I mean? Sort of build us up. And, I can't say rest it because it's a bit rude. But <laughs> it gets us going. You know what I mean? Before we, we go live. Yeah. And what about anything in the future on the horizon? Have you got any, any yeah. plans for future albums? Or? Uh, yeah. We're actually anything looking else? at maybe releasing uh, another single. Right. Uh, and it's called Common Months, as well as recording a new song. Released yeah. maybe late summer, maybe late late. the year. Mm. Uh, just keep things fresh again, you know. But we are looking to do uh, another CD, probably looking by the end of the year to start actually recording and getting ideas down and stuff. So, new material will be on the way. Definitely, at least at the sort of end of the year, we will have maybe a new single coming out. Yeah. Just so, because the album, this album's only not even been out for a year yet, yeah. so it's still got some time yeah, to yeah. play with before we. I reckon by the end of the year, I think we will have I think a new cross, single. Cross them and by the end of the year, to be over in the States. To yeah, that's plans, States. yeah. Right. So, okay, for them, it's, uh, it's, it's new because they've never, they've never toured there, so that will be new for them. So, you know. Just don't want to record something too early when we haven't actually right. you know, got no, full exposure difficult, for it. difficult know? to do, yeah. to break it out there yeah, as well. Uh, just get in a van, just drive a bit. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Old yeah. school. Yeah. Okay, well, uh, okay. that's a wrap then. Uh, cool, excellent. Cheers, man. And uh, enjoy your gig tonight and hope it goes well. Oh, cheers. Perfect. All the best for the future. Excellent. Cheers. 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 cheers.